Hello, welcome to Math with Niall. Today we'll be finding missing numbers in addition and subtraction. Okay, Niall, so we'll be doing some addition and subtraction questions. And which missing numbers are you finding? Um, the, the boxes with nothing in it. That's where I'm going to write the missing numbers. Okay, brilliant. Should we start with the first question? Oh, yeah, and we also have addition and subtraction. So you've got to pay attention mm -hmm. to whether it's addition or subtraction. So you want to start with the first question? So this is addition we're starting with. Mm -hmm. So it has to equal 7... Seven, eight, what 778. 778. And what and columns do we start? What column do we start in? Always the top. Which column is that? Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. The wait. units column. The units. Top units. Okay, so let's start with the units. So what plus five equals eight? Five, six, seven, eight. That was easy. Three. Good. Three. And what's the next column? Um, the next column After is tens. Tens. How? Four plus a what equals five? Not five. I mean seven. Mm -hmm. Four, five, six, seven. Another three. It makes me feel like this one is going to be three again. Okay. Six to seven. Oh, one. One. And what column was that? That is the hundreds column. One hundred and forty-three. Plus 635 equals 778. Is that correct? It's correct. Brilliant. Let's go on to the second one. Okay. Um, 4 plus 1, 2 equals six. Start again. So where are you starting? I am starting in the units. Um, 4 plus 2 equals 6. Okay, so two's missing from there. Good. Two. And then two plus seven equals seven, eight, nine. Then we would put a nine there. Mm -hmm. And then, um, okay, so five add something will equal eight. What number? Three. Okay, 5 plus 3 is 8. So, okay, 9 something 7, take away, now we're doing take away. Okay. 7, 2 something equals something 6, 3. Okay, so what column are you going to start with? The units. Okay. 7, take away what equals 3? Four. Okay, seven take away four equals three. Next? Yes. Um, something take away two equals six. Six, seven, eight. Okay, so you can add them on to find the missing number. And then you take away two which will equal six. Okay, so eight. Take away two equals six, or to find eight, we can, you know, our number sentences, we can add the six to the two to get eight. Brilliant. Okay, so nine take away seven. Seven, eight, nine. Okay. So two. Two, good. Okay, brilliant. We are on to the last question. In this row. Okay, and then so we go back it, to addition. Is it subtraction or addition here? Subtraction. Okay, so start off with the units column straight away. Um, okay. What take away eight equals one? One more than eight, nine. Good. Ooh, five take away three. Three plus two equals five. The two do. And then 8 take away 4 equals 4. Is that accurate? That is correct. Good job. So 859 take away 438 is equal to 421. Very good. Okay, brilliant, Niall. Okay, let's go to the next row of questions. Okay.
Okay, look at me. So we're going to start this question. What's the problem that you see happening in that units column? Um, the 9 is bigger than 6. And so we're adding. We're adding. So it won't add to equal to 6. What will it add to equal to? 16. 16. And what will we do with the 1 when we get 16? Um, the 10s. We'll carry it to 10s column. You would column. put it over. Yes. So the 6 from the units will be written there and we carry the 1. So yeah. now you've got to figure out what? 9 plus what equals 16. Very good. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 7. It's 7. seven. So the 7 goes in the there. The mystery number. Okay. So does that work? Is 9 plus 7 equals 16? Yes. So we put the 6 and we carry the 1. And what do we do now? Now we don't do 3 plus 2. We do 1 plus 3 plus 2. Good. We, I would, me personally, yeah. I would do 1 to go to 2. So it would be 3 plus 3. Okay, so what would it add up to? 3 plus 3 equals 6. Okay, brilliant. Because 1 plus 2 equals 3. Okay. Six. Okay, and next? Um, one plus something equals eight. That should be easy. One plus seven equals eight. One plus seven. Okay, good. We've got two Brilliant. sevens. So you've done that correctly. So these questions are trickier. Okay, so let's see if you can Wait, use what you've done. To... Okay. Let's see if you can use what you've done in the last question in this one. So can you explain where you're going to start? In the unit. Okay. Always start in the unit. Yes. Wait, if this is adding, then... It is adding. So that would be 15. So can you explain what you're saying? Um, because you can't do that, it would, because it's smaller... Because what is smaller than what? Because 5 is smaller than 7. If you add something, it wouldn't equal 7. It wouldn't equal... Equal 5, sorry. So if you add a number to 7, it won't equal 5. So that means it will equal to... 15. Yes. And then the 1 would go over here, the 10th okay. one. Brilliant. So what number will add to 7 to make 15? 15. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. What is it? 8. Okay. 8, 8, so 8, 8, 8, 8. Stand to the side so we can see. Good. Now, 1 plus 3 equals 4 plus what equals 8? 4 plus 4 equals 8. Okay, brilliant. 4 is half of 8. Ooh, this is so, so we're going into our thousands. Okay. So, the last question has numbers in thousands when you're writing. I it mean, does, but yeah. pay attention to the question that you're on. Um, 6 add 9, we can start with 9. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So it equals 15. Okay. So you would put a 5 here. Yes. And then a 1 would go up here. Yes. And then that 1 would come down here. So, 1,500, wait one sec, Okay, so read out the entire question with the answer. 638 add 947 equals 1,585. Wow. Brilliant. Okay, next one. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. We do an addition or subtraction? Subtraction. Okay. So, mm -hmm. um, what take away 9 equals 3? 9, 10, 11, 12. 12. 12. 12. So what number will be there? 2. 2 will be there. And for it to become 12, we will need a 1 to go with the 2. And where would the 1 come from? The 1 would come from the 10s. Yes, so remove that 7, remove the magnetic 7, and write in a normal 7 with your pen. 
Okay, so let's go again. So you figured out that 12 take away 9 equals 3. But you don't have 12 yet, you still have 2. So where are you going to get the 1 to make 12? I'll cross out the 7, and then I'll put a 1. No. I mean, I'll put a 6, and yeah. then I'll put a 1. Okay, so you've taken 1 from the 10s, and that's given you enough to get the 12. Yes. yes. So, so now does that work? 12 take away 9 equals 3. Yes. Yes. So what are you left with in the tens? Six, not seven anymore. Mm -hmm. So six take away zero equals six. Yes. Six, six. Six take away nothing equals six. Mm -hmm. And then something take away four equals one. Hmm. Hmm. Five take Five. away four equals one. Okay, good. Good job, Niall. Okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> let's look at that question. <laughs> okay. Okay, Niall, are you ready for that last one? Yes, I am ready. It looks tricky. It's very tricky. Where are you going to start? Um, I am going to start in the unit corner. Are we doing subtraction or addition? Subtraction. Okay, so start in the units, explaining as you go along. Four take away nine. You can't do that. So you would put a one there, and then we would take away one from that one there. So you'd be taking one from the tens column? Yeah. But you don't know what the tens is yet? No. Okay, so... Fourteen take away nine, mm -hmm. because the one makes it fourteen. Good. Um, so 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 yes. would equal 5. Yes. So we've got a 5 there. Good. And then what's happening in that 10s column? And then in the 10s column, um, there will be... So what do we have on top? Something take away 3 equals 3. So what is what would that be for it to be... Correct. It would be 7. Why and then, is it 7? Because 6 take away 3 is 3. Because you need to cross the 7 out and then put a 6 up here. Why have you crossed the 7 out? Because we've taken a 1 off it, from it. Oh, the 1 from one. 14. Yeah. yeah, so it would have had to be 7 first. So and if you took 1, is left with 6. So is that correct now? Is the tens column correct now? A six take away three equals three, yes. Very good. Okay. Okay, now we will do one take away something equals five. Hmm. hmm. You can't do that. You can't do that. So, so I'll take away this eight. Okay. I'll draw an eight here. Yes. I'll close this eight out. I'll put a seven here. Yes, very good. And then... I'll put that one here, so 11 take away something equals 5. Okay. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So how much is it? 6. Okay, so 11 take away 6 is 5. And then there would be another square here with a 0 inside. Okay, so there are no thousands. So 7 add 0. Add? Take away 0. Yes. Seven take away zero equals seven. Okay, so with all those crossing crosses and ones written in, can you remember what the original number is? The original number. The original is question. One hundred. No. Eight thousand mm -hmm. one hundred and seventy-four take away. Six hundred and thirty-nine is equal to is equal to seven thousand five hundred and thirty-five. Very good. Okay, so we've come to the end of oh, today's okay. lesson. Hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, subscribe now. Bye. Don't forget to press that like button. Bye.